Power plants, fracking for gas, and drilling for oil are all allies synonymous with global warming. Head out just to the west of Berlin and slicing through the farmlands of Brandenburg, hundreds of wind turbines are a standout feature. All part of Germany's plan to abandon nuclear power and switch to renewable energy. The goal, to generate clean energy. You might think that environmentalists are happy, but some are not. What really can make this difference is to have a clear map on the places where um, nature is not put at risk and where renewables can um, do their work, a work that we really need. The thumping sound of the giant blades can be heard throughout the quiet farmlands, a sign that Germany has fully adopted its green agenda and aiming to meet its climate goals and becoming greenhouse gas neutral by 2050. But before getting there, there's another hurdle, the European Court of Justice. The European Court of Justice ruled in favor of a citizen's initiative that want to prevent wind turbines in their neighborhood. Their argument, increasingly frequent cause of death for birds is the collision with a wind turbine. We need action from our, um, uh, from our governments, from our, our public administrations. They have to take this seriously. And we also need actions from the developers, of, uh, from the industry of renewables. They are going to have a huge business uh, in the next 10 years and the next 20 years, and they have to be responsible. If they want to really, really tackle the climate change, they, they have to be responsible on how and why and where they install their plants. Onshore wind power expansion in Germany is set to slow down after earlier this month, the European Court of Justice reinforced bird protection in wind turbine construction projects. Wind turbines are often cited as being particularly bad for birds and bats. Birds of prey, for instance, have a blind spot in front of them and look down as they search for food. Collision with unseen giant blades can easily prove fatal. But numerous other studies have shown that birth deaths caused by wind turbines are much lower than other human-related causes, such as power lines or collisions with tall buildings. There is a fierce debate across Germany over the idea of developing more wind power. Some claim that it's one of the only ways of abandoning nuclear energy and becoming more fossil fuel neutral, while others say that it's not only tearing up the countryside, but it's destroying the already poorly protected biodiversity in Germany. Well, the real question is, can there be a balance? Well, the German government says that there is. There is always a problem with the conservation of landscape and nature if we want to have energy. And the big advantages of solar and wind turbines is that we really discuss all the environmental aspects that uh, now come up when we build on wind turbines, parks, fields. The opponents have been examining the mechanical skyline and warn of what they see as the dangers of too much wind energy. With a number of lawsuits slowing down the construction of wind farms by three to five years, Germany's environmental goals could be gone with the wind. Evangelo Sipsas for CGTN, Berlin.